Hi everybody, Richie here. Now the last week has seen a couple of significant updates to the Google Glass firmware. In fact, just a couple of hours ago, Glass updated on my device to 18.11. So let's see what some of the new features are. The first one is an experimental feature that came through a few days ago called Glance Notification. Usually when you hear a chime to notify you of a message, you either have to touch your glass or tilt your head to activate it. Now when that chime comes through, all you have to do is move your eyeball up to the screen and it will light up with the message, which you can then respond to. Okay glass, reply, yes it certainly did. Now based on my few times I've used it, it doesn't always work, but when it does, you do feel like Glass is intuitively responding to you, kind of like Google Now made flesh, or in this case, titanium and plastic. And the great thing is, it's all hands-free from receiving the message to replying. Now the next feature is one of the new ones from the latest 18.1 release, and it also requires the latest version of the My Glass app. Whenever you take a photo, it will appear automatically on your My Glass screen, and you can then open it, add a filter, crop it, share socially, or just save it. And to be honest, it's such an obvious feature that it now would seem weird without it. Now the great thing is that just like direct Wi-Fi, there's no data connection required. It's a straight line from your glass to your smartphone. The next couple of features are smaller ones, but could be useful if you are A, a football fanatic, or B, a car driver. First up is a FIFA World Cup update service. You set up your Google Now account to add your favorite teams of the World Cup, and you'll then get score updates come through as part of your Google Now card pile. Parking location is another feature, which sounds pretty useful. This one will help you remember where you parked your car and provide a map to get you back to the car as soon as possible. Now in my short time with Glass, battery anxiety has been very high on my agenda. Now the latest My Glass app will alert you on your smartphone when your glass gets to below 20% capacity, and it's definitely time to store or charge soon if you get that message. So with the latest round of updates, there's definitely more functionality and usability coming through. And as someone very new to Google Glass, it has definitely been cool to see so many updates come through so regularly. So that's the latest update for uh, Google Glass News. Feel free to give a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe if you want to see more. Thanks for watching and I'll be back soon with more news, hands-on specials and fun. Until next time.